everyone and welcome to today's home live streaming. My name is Noemi Simon and I'm a sales agent at Lucas Fox. Today we will be showing you a stunning 170 square meter apartment in the neighborhood of Achampla, right? Just two streets from Passage de San Juan. But before we get started, I would like to remind you that if you have any questions throughout this home live stream, you can ask anything you like using the live chat and we'll be answering to all your questions. First of all, I'd like to highlight some of the key aspects of the property and then we'll be showing you in more detail each of the different areas in the apartment so you get a full perspective and a better understanding about its layout. Let's get started first of all talking a little bit about its location. We are in one of the most privileged areas in the city in the Champla right. We can go pretty much anywhere we want by walk. We have all sorts of services like different supermarkets, bars, restaurants. We have Passage de San Juan just two streets from here so we can have beautiful walks and access nice green areas if we want to relax and unwind any time of the the day and we're also very close by an international school so it's ideal for those of you who want uh, international studies for your ch your children in case you have children it is a great opportunity uh, for those of you looking for first or second residence because it's very spacious it's 170 square meters and it's composed of five bedrooms three bathrooms a fully equipped kitchen and a little laundry space there's also double orientation, which is great. We have direct sunlight during the day in this area of the apartment and nice sunlight during the afternoon on the other side of the apartment. Let's talk a little bit about the renovation project. It was finished not long ago and the apartment is on the fourth floor of a building that dates back to 1915. So it's equipped with an elevator and has all sorts of commodities that we will be mentioning throughout the whole live stream. So let's get started now with the video tour and the first area I'd like to show you is this room over here. As you can see, it's very spacious and airy, very sunny as well because we have tall windows that go pretty much from uh, the floor to the ceiling. And they also lead out to beautiful balconies so we can enjoy the beautiful weather in the city. The carpentry is the original one. It's super high quality because it was equipped with double glazed windows which insulate uh, the apartment. So it's both soundproof and heat proof which is ideal for uh, energy consumption. We also have air conditioning and heating system. The air conditioning is via splits and the heating system is ga via gas radiators. As you can see, this room over here connects with the second room, uh, but these two rooms could be easily separated using the original carpentry, which can be fixed, or it could be easily separated using a wall. This second room is ideal to be used as a main bedroom because we have a separate room that's connected to this one and could be turned into a walk-in closet very easily. We also have beautiful tall windows here that lead out to another balcony facing the street. And the most shocking thing about the apartment is how beautifully it was renovated. As you can see, we have uh, the original tile flooring and also beautiful moldings on the ceilings that were painted just uh, to make a statement piece in each room. As I told you, this door leads into another room that could be easily a bedroom because it's big enough to be a double bedroom. But since it's interior and it connects with the one next door, it would be great as a walk-in closet, an office space or anything that suits your lifestyle best. As we walk out of this room, we find these double doors that allow us to separate all the rooms we saw from the rest of the apartment. We also have a video come, which is very, very practical in apartments like this, because being such a big apartment, you have to walk long distances to go from one side to the other. 
and this would be bedroom number four as you can tell uh, it's also a double bedroom it's facing um, an interior courtyard so it's very uh, peaceful there is a school next door but because we have uh, this special carpentry which in this case is new um, we don't hear anything at all also, the bedroom has this extra space right here, which could be also turned into a reading corner or a little vanity space to get ready or even a walk-in closet as well because it's big enough. And as we walk outside, the first thing we find is the main door. So this is the main access to the apartment with the hall. Over here is bathroom number one. It's a full bathroom with a double shower, double sink, the um, radiator for towels, and also the toilet. I would like to point out that really nice materials were used during the renovation project as for example micro cement in the uh, toilet as well as micro cement on the floor uh, which acts as a frame for the original period feature uh, flooring. Over here we find uh, another set of double doors that can uh, allow us to separate the day area from the night area. As you can see the corridor is very white and unlike other Ashambla apartments we have sunlight at the center. This is very difficult to find because usually the center of Ashambla apartments are facing interior uh, patios with almost no light but in this case we're lucky enough to have windows and direct sunlight in this area too. The kitchen is fully equipped as you can see it has a very modern and chic design and over here we have a table that can be double up as an island to cook as cooking countertop space or also use it as a bar to have casual breakfast or lunch. Over here we find the sink which is um, conveniently placed next to the dishwasher which is by the brand Belay. Over here is the gas extractor and the induction hub. We have plenty of drawers and cabinets of different depths so it's very easy to um, store away anything that needs to be organized. We have a full-size refrigerator by the brand Ballet as well and a full-size freezer as well right next to it. Also, as a fun fact, this apartment used to be an office space. It was later on turned into residential use. So this area right here used to be the archive and they custom built all these shelves that you can move around. They're very, very practical and it can be used uh, as, for example, a laundry room with extra bed linen, extra towels, or even to store away some food and use part of it as pantry. And also, you know, have your cleaning supplies nice, organized and put away. And if we continue down the hallway, another thing we notice is that we have the original windows, same as in the, um, in the main entryway, with the original stained glass uh, windows and the carpentry as well. On the right hand side, we find a guest toilet. Very practical because it's in the day area. And next thing we find is this beautiful living and dining space. It is very spacious, very airy. We also have beautiful windows that go from side to side of this area. So they allow plenty of natural light, especially in the evening because we have like afternoon sun on this side of the apartment. North orientation on this side, south orientation on the other, which is great for ventilation as well. As you can see, this space is very bright, so it could be used as, for example, a formal dining room or we could turn it into an office now if we telework because we have this um, also double doors that allow us to separate this space from the rest of the day area, the living room and dining room. Last but not least, we find the master bedroom. It's a very spacious bedroom, as you can see, with plenty of space for a king-size bed and some extra space for a couple of chairs. 
uh, just to relax and have a reading corner. Over here we have this extra space called gallery in this type of apartments here in Barcelona and it could be a great place to have a vanity or to have, as I said, your uh, chill out space inside your own suite or even a walk-in closet which is even more practical. And being the master suite, of course, it has an ensuite bathroom. The bathroom was beautifully done. As you can see, we have a double shower, the suspended toilet and suspended double sinks. There's also LED lighting fixtures around the mirror and we also have the same towel dryer as in the other bathroom. This completes pretty much every single space in the apartment. Now I would like to go back to the night area where we welcomed you and do a little wrap up with uh, all the details mentioned so far, as well as reveal the selling price. So please follow me. the apartment is ready to move in it was recently renovated and it's 170 square meters um, divided into five different bedrooms three bathrooms with a fully equipped kitchen and the extra space as a laundry room we also have beautiful balconies on the side of the apartment that's facing the street and beautiful tall windows with uh, gallery spaces that can be used as multi-purpose spaces um, the apartment is on the fourth floor of a building which dates back to 1915, equipped with elevator, as we said. Uh, so it's a great opportunity, uh, both as first or second residence. To this point, I don't know if anybody has any questions about the property or about the area where it's in. So if you have any doubts, please send us an email at infolf at lucasfox.com. If you'd like to visit any of our other properties, please be sure to visit our website, www.lucasfox.com. And last but not least, I'd like to reveal the selling price, which is 985,000 euros. It's a great price considering the quality of the renovation project, the privileged area we're in, and the amount of square meters we have. So if you'd like to get any help, please contact us and we'll be happy to assist. It was my pleasure showing you around this beautiful apartment today, and I hope to see you again very soon. Have a nice day.